How to Babysat a Grandpa by Jean Reagan, illustrated by Lee Wildish. How to Babysat a Grandpa. Thank you for this awesome book, Mac. Opa and Oma love it. Babysitting a grandpa is fun, if you know how. When your grandpa rings the doorbell, what should you do? Hide! That's right. You have to hide. You might wiggle and want to giggle, but don't yell, Grandpa! Not yet. Shh! This is how to stay quiet. Pretend you're a shark waiting for lunch. Act like a pirate spy. Be as still as a lion statue. And as soon as your grandpa says, I give up, pop out and shout, Here I am! When your mom and dad leave, pat your grandpa's hand and say, Don't worry, they always come back. Then right away, ask him if he's hungry. Snack ideas for grandpa. Cream topped with cookies. Olives served on fingertips. Anything dipped in ketchup. Cookies topped with ice cream. After snacks, it's time to take your grandpa for a walk. When it's cold, make sure to bundle up. And when it's sunny, sunscreen up especially the top of his head. Remember to grab his hand when you cross the street and remind him to look both ways. What to do on a walk. Step over sidewalk cracks. Look for lizards, cool puffs, and dandelion. And if there is a puddle or sprinkler, show him what to do. When you're back at home, have him shut his eyes while you get ready. And then, how to entertain a grandpa. Summer cross, summer call, cross. Someone saw across the room. Put on a scary play. Show off your muscles. You may want to have some extra tricks. Grandpas always clap for more. Pretty soon, he'll want to join the fun. So play with Grandpa, too. How to play with a Grandpa. March with your drum. Build a pirate cave. Make sure you both fit in. Watch out for sharks in the water. Don't let your feet touch the floor. When your grandpa says, nap time, it's time for his nap. The best way to put to sleep is to have him read a long book over and over and over and over and even if you're sleepy too babysitters have to stay awake while he naps draw a picture for his fridge what to draw for a grandpa? A pirate shark battle. Your favorite dinosaur. You and your grandpa splashing in a puddle. Then, wake your grandpa up. <laughs> you might want to try this. Lifting him with your muscles. Tickling his nose and toes. Singing on top of Old Smokey. 
softly, then louder, and louder. Now we ask, will mom and dad be home soon? Your grandpa will look at the clock and say, yikes, very soon. Good babysitters can't leave messes, so turn on some bouncy music and get to work. And when you hear your mom and dad, grab your grandpa's hand and pull him behind the couch. Show him how to be quiet. Check how to stay quiet and whisper. See, Grandpa, they always come back. Now comes the hardest part, the goodbye time. How to say goodbye to Grandpa. Surprise him with a picture. A hug and kiss, a hug and kiss, and another hug and kiss. And then ask, when can I babysit you again? The end. Thank you for this awesome book. We'll treasure it forever. Love, Oma and Opa. <laughs>